Battle Hero of t e n Alright, going back. It doesn't surprise me that we're going back here, but I've always said that Palutena is just like the character that you learn your fundamentals on. Like, Team Fundies is like through Palutena, uh, has always been kind of like Wolf Lucina Palutena is like your day one characters. Yeah. If you don't know Palutena matchup by now, like, where have you been for the first like four years of this game? She's still really good. Absolutely. Okay. See Snagger trying to see any way he can count, gonna get into some type of conversion against these Blood Paul. Uh, get a decent start, but of course, no stocks taken just yet. Gets the accelerator and just flies off the spell already. Only on five mana, but does it really matter? Yeah, honestly, all that Paul really needs to do at this point is just, you know, hit one of those like fair combos and boom, you're already at almost like a fifth of your meter essentially back already. So sure. you just play a little bit more aggressively, you can get something started. But Snagger doing a really great job of keeping Paul on the side right now, trying to get something going, but weaves the back air. And that's something that I love about Paul's gameplay right now is that he weaves the back air extremely well. Okay. Don't know what was going on right there. Um. <laughs> Bring us back to... Uh, I actually think we're... If production can hear us, we're actually looking at the OBS scene. If we could just minimize that, because I think our view is correct. Okay. Because I think you're supposed to hit minimize over here for us. Because we're seeing a completely different uh, layout than you are. Because we definitely have the stream. Yeah. Okay. Stay here. Okay. Let me <laughs> <Stay> <laughs> full screen. <back. laughs> we're good. We're good. <laughs> Listen, man. The quad. 
Quad is uh, technologically advanced, even for me. Still though, miss a couple of minutes of that of that game, but totally fine. Uh, still though, Paul definitely up. Okay, you can see what in the was that a flat? Yeah, it was a flat. Almost like flew into it too, which is the scariest part. But it seems like Snagger on the last stock again, and Paul up too. Feels like we got some sort of flow going, but Paul going to self destruct. I don't know if he had enough mana and attacks to kind of get back right there. He's kind of just letting the spells fly. Sets off the Kaboom again and gets the stock and damn. Really converting off these things. Off these spells. We got Guy Guy Phantom. I'll okay. Guy Guy Phantom. What letter is that, sorry? Uh, that is... Oh, or we got K. If we, if we want to go the production... Stop battle. Corey. Uh, we're gonna see what we can get going on back into this Corey. set and the beast mode all trying out the cards and you know what i'm a little bit up why not <laughs> yeah it's up two stock or two games to one i believe so things are looking real good to just give our secondary a good old try it's looking and, nice too yeah i was about to say it doesn't look like it's uh suffering too much i know the paul shattuck set at um at riptide was a heartbreaker for shattuck but honestly uh paul has a history of playing the characters with the sword paul did play uh sephiroth for a long time yep. before like kind of switching full on over to hero uh but honestly at this point everybody got a corn why not that character is very very meta right now they used to be anti meta but i think a lot of more people are kind of figuring out hey man they got a lot of good matchups must start playing them yeah absolutely and you could play this character like the, the pin is so good and the once again, we're talking about like aerial flow. Corn has so much aerial flow yeah. here, so Paul trying to get something started, but Snagger's still definitely not out of this, but just has to find a way to get this stock off because I feel like Paul's spacing right now, it, it's slapped on Corin, but it's so hero reminiscent. Yeah. <laughs> just wants to back it any way he can. No spells needed though this time. Just gonna work with the normals by herself. Keep it nice and clean. 
Still, though, trying to get something started. Landing Nair. Corn Nair, too. Like, so many things on this character look so and feel so good here. Yeah. There we go. There's the back throw, though. Paul going to be off. Auto Reticle does not go off. The great parry. And I love how Paul didn't just go for an attack, but instead prioritized returning to center stage and just getting an advantage for maybe potentially even a pin off the side. No down to convert. He's actually right there, Lyrically. He could have gone for a lot of options there. And okay, never mind. We're going to see what he can do next. The F tilt getting shielded right there. Nothing from it to convert. Wants to pin the down air too. A lot of buttons are being thrown out uh, from Beast Mode Paul, but no kind of answer back from Snagger until now that they're back at. Yeah, gotta, gotta figure it out though. Gotta find the chase. The air dodge isn't caught out by Paul. Paul's just waiting for Snagger to kind of crack out a shield, but there is the, the Nair once more. There it is. The up throw will do it. Paul going to win this set 3 0 with two games of Hero and one game of Core. Good luck with it. I'm gonna go right back I'll give it this. up. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give it up for sure.